Now we have a graph before us. I'll draw it to you how a firm can earn supernormal profits. Supernormal profits are economic profits. For accounts, it is supernormal profit. For economics, that is normal profits. Now let's assume. that this is the marginal cost curve for the firm. So can you tell me what would be the equilibrium quantity for the firm? How much should the firm produce and sell in the market? Yes, correct. The firm should sell ON units in the market because our first order condition is MC should be equal to MR. So my MR is this curve, which is horizontal to X axis and MC I've just drawn before you. They both are meeting at this point. Let's name this point as E. And the second order condition is MC should cut MR from below. Is it cutting it from below? Yes. So this becomes the equilibrium point and ON number of units becomes the equilibrium quantity that the seller should produce and sell in the market. Correct. So now if he is producing ON number of units, let's see if he will be incurring profits or losses or he will be breaking even. Let's see. Now let's assume this is the average total cost curve for the firm. Now how do you know the firm is actually earning profits or it is at a situation of break even or it is at a situation of incurring losses. So the important thing to note is at equilibrium see how AR and ATC are placed. So this is the quantity. ON is the quantity and at this quantity, how much is the average total cost? What is the average total cost? The average total cost is this much. This is the average total cost. And what is the average total revenue? The average total revenue is this much, this whole. So average revenue exceeds the average total cost. Here we can see AR is more than ATC. Thus, the firm would have a situation of super normal profits and what would be the amount of profit we know that revenue minus cost equal to profit so what is the revenue here this whole my revenue is this much this whole green line and what is the cost my cost is up till here. So what is the quantum of profit? I would say this is the quantum of profit that the firm would be earning because this is my revenue and this is my cost. So this becomes my profit. 
So by selling O n number of units, this shaded region would be the amount of profit that the firm would be incurring. So please note that at equilibrium when ATC is less than AR, when ATC is less than AR, you will have a situation of supernormal profits. This is my supernormal profits. Okay. The same is shown in this graph as well. I've just drawn a situation wherein you will get supernormal profits.